Okay, guys, I am back with another unboxing. Two of them. Well, the next one's going to be in the next video. So, yes, I forgot to tell you guys from this little Peacemaker action figure unboxing I filmed last night and uploaded it last night. I forgot to tell you I was doing an unboxing video today, which... The Bleacher Creatures, I didn't even know they were being delivered today. I thought they were going to be delivered till tomorrow. But anyway, um, I got this from eBay like four days ago on the, at the end of last month, which was four days ago. So, can't wait to see what it is. I think it was that, I think it was Here Comes the Pain. I only got the disc, mostly the case, yeah, see, here's the case, and the disc, but anyway guys, this unboxing and review is going to get 100 out of 100. Hope you guys like, comment, subscribe. So, okay, so, anyway, um, yes, I want to save this one the last, I mean, I don't know why I saved the last video, but stay tuned for the actual Bleacher Creature Cody Rhodes unboxing in the next video. But this one we are doing the, another Coricha plush. This time it's going to be Randy Orton, the man who just signed to the SmackDown brand three days ago on SmackDown. So let's go ahead and get him out of the bag. Get him, I mean, out of the bag. So here we go. And three, two, one. Okay, guys. So, yes, I'm not using this in a plush videos for the newer ones, like... For the rest of 2023, nor the beginning of 2024. Uh, this is for display. Uh, sadly, the jacket is not removable. But let's go ahead and take the tags off of him and see what he looks like without the tags on. And three, two, one. Okay, guys. So here's the tag. Here he is without the tag on. So here's the little s detail. So he only has like two logos. This one's the RKO and the Legend Killer logo. And um, yeah, first time I saw this, I uh, had it on my wish list since like two weeks ago. And now I finally bought it. And yes, uh, again, um, some of y'all may know my birthday is coming up. So uh, stay tuned for a plush video that day also. And one for tomorrow. So anyway, guys, and December 8th. So hope you guys like, comment, subscribe. Okay, so I know y'all have been waiting for this moment. The... 10 inch Cody Rose figure. Plushy figure. I don't know why I say 10 inch figure because it's just a plushie. So, yep, here's the American Nightmare and Bleacher Creature form. And let me go get the other one that I did an unboxing on and reviewed over a year ago. So, here we go. Here's the Coricha Cody Rose one I reviewed a year ago. And here is the American Nightmare in Bleacher Creature form that I just ordered a few days ago. Which I was supposed to unbox this three or four, well mostly three months ago, but never got around to it. So let's go ahead and get him out of the bag. In three, two, one. Okay guys, so here is the American Nightmare out of the bag. Um... His hair is kind of floppy. Um, he has the exact same attire on, just like this one does. And, well, 
This one's going to be for display too, because never used this in a plus video. I was supposed to, but I never got around to it. So, yep. Let's go ahead and take the tags off and see what Cuddy Rhodes looks like without the tags on, shall we? Okay, guys. So, before I took the... the I didn't even took the other tag off yet. So, here is the picture. The American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. Pretty cool. Now, I'm going to take the little hanger off. So, be right back. Okay, guys. So, yep. Should I just leave his hair like how it is, or... Okay, I'm gonna leave it how it. I'm gonna leave it like how it is. But here is the tags off of him, and this bleacher creature plushie is gonna get a hundred out of a hundred for the review. But anyway, guys, um, hope you guys like, comment, subscribe. Hey guys, um. Yes, I know, uh, I did a unboxings, like, three days ago. One of them, okay, I am going to replace because it didn't work. So, yep, and y'all know I am talking about Here Comes the Pain. That is the 20-year-old WWE game that's expensive. So, but I got this from eBay, I actually bought this about Saturday of last week, but uh, yes, um, it's not going to be like WWE, My Little Pony, My Hero, or other anime related. It's actually going to be a Littlest Pet Shop related. Yes, I know what Littlest Pet Shop is. They're also owned by Hasbro, just like My Little Pony, and... Uh, Transformers, G.I. Joe, and Marvel stuff for, like, Marvel movies and others. But let's go ahead and get it out of the bag and see what it is. So, check this out. It's a Zoe Trent plushie. Sadly, no tag. But, yes, first time I saw this character about 10 years ago... A lot of people say she looks exactly like Twilight Sparkle because of the colors and all that. But let's go ahead and get the her get this out of the bag. Like get Zoe out of the bag and give it a review. So here we go. So here's uh here she is out of the bag. Pretty well detailed. Did and there's the little like tag right there. And, yes, this plushie was released about nine years ago. And this plushie review is going to get a hundred out of a hundred. But, stay tuned for another plushie review tomorrow. But, anyway, guys, hope you guys like, comment, subscribe. So, yes, um... I haven't done a Mutant Mayhem plushie review since, like, three months ago. But, we're taking a look at Rock Steady. Um, yes, I got this plushie for my John Cena collection. For, um, well, you know. Because, um, some of y'all may know, I am getting into collecting, like, Peacemaker merch. But, yes, I forgot John Cena is in the movie. Voicing Rock City. So, yep, uh, here's the plushie itself. There's the tag. Which, sadly, no, like, picture on the tag. But yep, let's go ahead and take the tag of Rock Study and review it. So here we go. Okay, guys. So here is Rock Steady without the 
tag on. And yes, Mattel did make this one too. Pretty like I pretty like the pants. They actually remind me of the the John Cena shorts where he wears camouflage shorts. And he had and he got a little bracelet on. And a gold tooth. But anyway, guys, this plus review is gonna get a hundred out of a hundred. Hope you guys like, comment, subscribe. So yes, I know I did like a like an unboxing video a few days in a row, but today is an unboxing day, so which this was supposed to be delivered at my house yesterday, but never got delivered. Um pretty cool um bag right here. I mean and uh I don't know. But let's go ahead and get this out and see what I got. So check this out. I got a Cutie Mark Crew Rainbow Dash plush. Um again, this was supposed to be delivered yesterday. And yes, this is this is for plush videos. And let's go ahead and take the tag off. Okay, guys. So Here's the tag, and yes, it's made by Toy Factory and Hasbro. You know, the toy company, like I said, that makes Transformers, G.I. Joe, My Little Pony, and Marvel stuff like uh, Spider-Man, Iron Man. So, here it is. Um, Sally, she does not have her cutie mark there, but anyway, this plush review is going to get a hundred out of a hundred. Hope you guys like, comment, subscribe, but before, like I said, I end the video, this is for a plush skid, but anyway, like, comment, subscribe.